Good day to all. Today, I will be discussing with you basic concept on sets, part 2. For today's objectives, you will learn to identify notations and symbols related to sets, determine ways of describing sets, and list the elements in a set. In dealing with sets, we have notations and symbols we need to remember. We use capital letters or big letters to denote a set. We use lowercase or small letters to denote the elements of the set. List elements of a set using braces and separate these elements by commas. A set contains many elements. We often use three dots and these three dots is called as ellipsis. of a set, each distinct element is listed once and the order of element does not matter. And lastly, the symbol is read as is an element of, while the symbol is read as not an element of. Example number one, set of vowel letters. So we have set V for vowel letters. And the elements are A, E, I, O, U. Another thing is, A is an element of V. O is an element of B, but M is not an element of B. Hindi siya member ng vowel. Next, set of primary colors. So, colors, set C. We have red, yellow, and blue. Yellow is an element of C. Blue is an element of C. But green is not an element of C. Third, Set of full numbers less than 10. So 0 up to 9. 3 is an element of W. 8 is an element of W. But 10 is not an element of W. Ways of describing a set. We have three ways of describing a set. First, we have the roster notation or what we call the listing method. This is a method describing a set by listing each element of the set inside the symbol braces. This is an example. Set A composed of elements M, A, E, H, E, I, C, S. Second way is the verbal description method. From the word verbal, it is a method describing a set in words. Example, set A is the letters in the word mathematics. Third is the set builder notation. It is a method that lists the rules that determine whether an object is an element of the set rather than the actual elements. Example, set A, elements X, such as X, is a letter in the word mathematics. So 
supply the missing elements of each set then describe what kind of set is being formed. The missing elements in number 1 are Pacific and Indian. These sets is known as the names of the oceans of the world. For number 2, the missing elements are Hufflepuff and Slytherin. They are the characters from the story Harry Potter. While number 3, Elite, Master, and Mythic are the ranks from the Mobile Legend. And the last, Li, are the missing elements from the letters of the name Ellie Jane. Activity number 3. List or identify the elements for each given set. Sorry, it's DJ. DJ If others can, why can't you? So kung nagustuhan mo ang video na to, please like and share it now. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Sorry, DJ. Thank you for watching my video. Again, this is Mrs. Ellie Jane Ruedas, your math teacher. You can get some.